Well, Richard, you've made it. You've hit a massive life milestone and we're so incredibly excited. That said, you turned 70 on a pretty bizarre year. We want nothing more than to be by your side eating cake and drinking wine. Although hopefully not at the same time. Ew. While on a grand adventure through a Parisian neighborhood. Or a tropical island. Or a ski mountain. Or a European riverboat. Or European riverboat. However, we're going to have to save that celebration for just a little longer. Until that time, we've come together on this video to wish you the happiest possible birthday. We love, we love you. you. I can't wait to celebrate. <laughs> Until we can get the whole family together again, we hope you enjoyed this video from all of us. Hi Richard, it's Lindsay Lowen. I want to wish you a very blessed and beautiful happy birthday, 70th birthday. And if you ask me, I mean a dad is an irreplaceable person in life. Think about it. It's a whole day devoted to celebrating fathers. Just imagine someone's life without a father. Never buying a Father's Day card, never sitting on their father's lap, never being able to say, hi dad, or what's up dad, or catch you later dad. I mean, a baby's first words are always dad, dad, aren't they? Let me see if I get this. Do you miss being able to call me dad? Yeah, I really have, dad. Your children love you very much. Um, and I wish I could be there to celebrate with you guys, but sending you lots of love and light. Have a nice glass of wine with your family and have a beautiful, blessed birthday. God bless. Hey, Richard. Happy birthday to you. Welcome to the 70s. Tell you the truth, I'm having a hard time getting my head around that one because if you're 70, we know this isn't the birthday you planned, but we wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Just want to say happy birthday. Happy birthday. Wish we could be with you, but you're always in our thoughts. I mean, 70 years is quite the accomplishment, and let me tell you, you wear it well. Happy birthday, Uncle Richard. I'm here in the land of the giant trees. Get it? Happy birthday! Happy birthday. It's your birthday! Happy birthday, Pop! Happy birthday, Pop! Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Pop! Happy birthday, Pop! Happy birthday, Pops! Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Dad. Happy birthday, Richard. I'll start sarcastically, say, you're old. <laughs> hey, Richard. Happy 70th birthday. Happy birthday, Richard. Happy birthday. Hi, Pop. I wanted to wish you a very happy birthday. I hope you have an awesome day. We're here just to wish you the happiest and happy birthdays in the world. Happy birthday, Cousin Richard from Cousin Laura. Wishing you a very happy birthday today and a fabulous year ahead. Happy birthday, Richard. Happy birthday, Richard. Happy birthday, Richard. Happy birthday, Uncle Richard. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Love, Ty and Eric. And Ty. Uh, <laughs> this is the Burdett family uh, wishing you a very happy birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Richard. Hey, Richard. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Can't believe you're 70. <laughs> Happy birthday, Richard. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Richard. Richard. Joyeux anniversary! Joyeux anniversary! Richard, happy 70th birthday from Mike and Janice. Hi, this is Carlton here. Just saying happy 40th birthday to Mr. Aiken. Happy 70th birthday, Mr. Aiken. Richard, happy 70th birthday. I wish you a very happy birthday. It was a wonderful year. Now, my godson said to me that I was only allowed to say one word to describe you. Well, I've thought hard about that word and I thought I'd never find one, but in actual fact, I think I've got the perfect solution. Richard, your family asked us to come up with a word to describe you and the word Terry and I came up with is loyal. And the word that I think describes you best is kind. One word that describes you the best is? Gentle. If we had one word to describe Richard, it would have to be gentlemen. And the word that uh, Antoinette and Eric have chosen is gentlemen. And for me, it's very kind and patient. The one word we came up with to describe Richard was gentlemen. The words that we would use to describe you are... Cheerful! Delightful! Generous! Thoughtful! That's tough, there's a lot of them. 
I guess gracious comes to mind. You are patient and giving. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it. Hey, Uncle Richard, happy birthday. Um, the word is, uh, My word for you would be gracious. You are a very loyal family member, both to your brothers and sisters and to your own family. One word just didn't work. We came up with two, and they are class act, because that's what you are, a class act. You've always done things the right way. You do it with style, and you always do it looking out for everybody that's involved in whatever it happens to be. You are such a kind, gentle, and caring person, so I couldn't pick one word. But that's what you've always been through my 40 years. Uh, engaging, 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 um, interesting, um, handsome, handsome. Uh, oh, look, can you just give it to me like that? I mean, you always do, right? You've done that for like 35 years. You've always like, cheated. So I'm, gonna, I'm just going to look at you, okay? During the 50 years I've known you, I've seen you be generous with your time, your knowledge, your leadership and your friendship. Richard, you've been loyal to the island of Montserrat. You maintain the traditions of uh, mothers and dad. He's an awesome boss. Uh, happy to be working for him. Thank you. You are a remarkable person. King. King Richard. King Richard the kind-hearted. The boss. <laughs> My boss is boss. <laughs> When I think of you, one word comes to mind, and that would be commitment. One of the words that I think best describes you is patient. Patrick, while he doesn't want me to recall the story, put a small dent in your car, and I remember him being pretty upset. But when he told you, your response was, you know what, like, that's okay. It's an aspect of your personality and your parenting that I really aspire to and really appreciate. When I think of you, I think of the word flip. Because from when we were very young to when we were much older, you had a marvelous way of sneaking up, throwing us over your shoulders and landing us back on our feet before we ever knew what hit us. You're flipping amazing. From my earliest memories, I remember cousin Richard coming over, being the fun guy and flipping us over his shoulder, getting us wound up and probably upsetting mom and dad with that. But we loved it. For all the years I've known you, I think you've been most loyal to Top Cider Shoes. My one word to describe you is omniscient. Lexophile came up for me. It doesn't mean you're an expert on Lexi, although you are. It does mean that you love words and word games and play on words and anagrams, etc. Richard, you're loyal to Nunu's Cheese Dip and Fritos. Pop. My word for you is bartender. Very thoughtful. My word to describe Richard is distinguished. And I thought for a long time, I spent most of the day thinking about this Richard, but I believe you to be royal. <laughs> and I also think of Flip because family, love, intelligence, and Pearson. Now, what word best describes Richard? Well, he does make a great Negroni. And an amazing pina colada. And he likes good food and good wine. He must be a, a connoisseur. Bye. How could we possibly mark this big birthday any other way than with this signature Richard Aiken candy toast? So here goes. Happy birthday to a true. Please no. This is serious stuff. You are quite literally a a real. A true trivia and silver screen, and always ready with a clever pun. So dare we say a bit of a, we hope this toast is a, during these challenging times, and that the birthday greetings you receive are, you deserve a love and appreciation. And we're real, so trust us on that. Seriously though, we are so thankful for all you've done for us over many, many years of friendship and family. We scored when we meet next door to you and Lexi. You have been a true, in so many ways, especially those difficult days in California 20 plus years ago, even if people assumed you were my, 
as you inadvertently helped me fold my underwear in that tacky laundromat in LA. So many meaningful memories and much love on this special birthday to a true. All of us fly McDonald's know that. And that's a perfect word to end on because you have been such a rock for our family, always constant, always there with your love and support. Happy, happy birthday. We love you so much. Happy birthday, Richard. There's many words I have to describe you. <laughs> all good, but if I would have to pick one, it would be kind hearted because that's all you've ever shown me in my life. Uh, from the, 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 when I was even younger than her. <laughs> Um, my one word for you would have to be gracious because you always open your heart to everyone you meet. All right, well, happy birthday, my dear man. I love you. I love you. Mwah. And if I were to choose one word to describe you, it would be warm-hearted. If you don't know what it means, you can look it up in the dictionary. And what it is, is with a kiss, a cuddle, and a squeeze is super fragilistic. Can't even say it. Super, super... Super can of fragilistic expiatidocious. Happy birthday, lots of love. If I ever went on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, you would be one of my phone of friends. Um, and also you're one of the sweetest people I know. Stumbled upon these that combine both words for you. So smart sweets. Um, so I also had to do the candy thing. Our one, one word, word to describe, describe Richard, Richard is that he's a great CEO. In our part of the country, that word means Chief Entertainment Officer. Richard, since 1969, I've enjoyed your company. And since 1979, we, we have, have enjoyed, enjoyed you and Lexi. I've got a glass of wine in my hand, and I remember the day that Richard and I moved into the house, and you appeared with a whole tray full of daiquiris and I remember that Lexi said you were a bit worried because you didn't know whether we drank or not. Well, over the years we have. We've had lots of drinks together and you've seen us through thick and thin and I'm really grateful for all you've done over the years and I wish you a very happy birthday. You have been a great neighbor. I often think of the many times Gert and I went and visited with you. We especially enjoyed being with Alexis's family for Bond Week. I've known you for most of my life and uh, you've taught me many things including uh, key games of cribbage and backgammon, lots of video games as a kid, enjoyed skiing with you, love how you've been to my sister. I truly hope you all is well and I wish you the best. Um, little note, be safe, stay strong, hold fast my friend. Kind and exuberant. So whether it's kind exuberant or exuberantly kind, you make everyone around you happier. But in conclusion, uh, I think that you've been loyal to your friends, uh, and they love you uh, as do we. And uh, you've been loyal to to the people you've known for a long time. I hope you have a great day. Uh, miss you. Um, okay, I gotta go. I wanna. Happy 30th, because this is, this is huge. Happy 30th. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Happy 70th. Happy 70th. We've come together in this video to forget your lines. <laughs> if we had one word to describe Richard Aiken, it would be generous. Generous. <laughs> generous. The word I chose to describe you is generous. And I'm not just talking about material generosity. The one that comes to mind is generosity. You're you're just so generous with everything that you've obtained in life, whether it be material, your houses, um, any, anything that you, that you can, that you have your hands on, that you've obtained yourself. You're, you're so giving with all of that and generous. And you're generous with your time, you're generous with your family, but most importantly, you're generous with your heart. And for that, I thank you for allowing me to be a part of that. You're a very wonderful human, both you and your incredible wife have done so much for me with that generosity of personal so thank you. And in terms of one word that I would use to describe you, I actually thought about this for a really long time and it's an impossible task. So I came up with two words and that will lead to many others, but essentially the word phrase that I came up with was loving 
kindness. And you've been such a significant figure in my life since I was a little, little kid. And you've remained a significant figure because from the moment, as long as I've known you, I've always felt loved and I've always felt kindness. And I think a lot of that comes from your being so welcoming, your being so generous, and your humility um, and the level of yeah, humility that you bring to everything that you do. So uh, happy birthday, happy 70th birthday, sending you hugs um, and all the best wishes. One word to describe Richard would just be welcoming. Uh, he was just always such a welcoming guy, especially when I joined the family, he welcomed me right into it. Uh, he's just such a gracious host, he welcomes everybody into his household, just everything about him is just brings that welcoming feel to it. If we had to describe you in one word, it would be the word welcoming. Well, I certainly agree with that. You welcomed us into your family. We want to wish you a happy 70th birthday. I want to wish you a wonderful happy birthday. You've been such a great godfather to me through all my years. One word I would use to describe you is refined. Um, you're uh, the consummate gentleman, you, you just know things, so. Family, you've always been an unbelievable family man, an unbelievable father. Uh, every time we get together, uh, family unquestionably is the focus uh, and the emphasis in your life, and, and we too uh, agree that's the most important thing. So um, you do it better than anyone. No matter what's going on, your family always comes first. For me, the word that I keep coming back to is the word dad. You uh, really do epitomize what it means to be a good father. You're patient, you're always there for me personally, but for all of your children. You love your family, all of us, <laughs> your children our spouses, your grandchildren, your siblings, your in-laws, your wife. Um, you take you take care of everybody um, and you always are there to help us through a problem. You may not give us the answers, um, but you always present us with plenty of options. Um, so for me, you just are truly the world's greatest dad. Love you to pieces and happiest of 70 birthdays to you. Love you. The word that Amy and I chose to best describe you, dad, is mentor. I've been alive for 30 years, and of all those 30 years, you have been a constant mentor to me. You are amazing at sort of projecting your knowledge onto others. Uh, that actually is the second reason why we chose mentors, because it's not just me. Whenever I'm in a room with other people, whether it's my peers, my siblings, uh, other family members, friends, uh, you know, my wife, I can see the impact that you have on them and the lessons that uh, they are absorbing from you. It really is impressive to be able to watch other people show so much respect for you. And for those reasons, uh, I can say undoubtedly that, that you are other people's mentor as well. One birthday wish that I have for you on this special day is that um, this pandemic and all that it requires us to do to be safe is is over speaking of loyal we wish we were loyal to being with you on your birthday but we can't because of this so covid19 we will miss you we covid19 has kept us away richard but nonetheless we toast we with... toast cheers 70 more happy birthday to our favorite lovable host love you you are the most ultimate gracious host happy birthday richard Here's a rough lunch to your 70th. I'm raising my glass to you today. Look forward to meeting you and the family out on the deck or the porch next summer. Happy, Happy 70th, 70th birthday, Richard. Enjoy your day. Happy 70th, Richard. Wish we could be there. Happy birthday, Uncle Richard. Happy birthday, Richard. Say happy birthday. God bless you, Uncle Richard. Happy birthday, Richard. Can't believe you're 70. Happy birthday, Richard. Since we can't be with you on your actual birthday, we've been focused on immersing ourselves in your favorite things. I hope you have a great day. We can't wait to get together with you soon to celebrate as a full family. I hope that you have an amazing day. I know we're not all there together this year, but know that we're all there with you in spirit, sending so much love from your other daughter. We're so sad that we can't be there with you um, on this huge milestone, but we love you so much. And we can't wait to celebrate with you soon. Happy birthday, Uncle Richard. Happy birthday, Uncle Richard. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Richard. So enjoy your birthday. And I wish you a very happy birthday. Happy birthday. Love you. We love you. We love you. Love you, Dad. Love you. Love you. Happy birthday.
We love you. Happy birthday. Happy 70th. We love you. Uh, love you very much. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Richard. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, old man. Happy birthday, Richard. Sorry this year is such a crazy birthday. We should all be together right now, laughing, eating, drinking, and making new memories. Instead, we're making different kind of memories. 2020 has been quite a year. I just want to wish my better half a great day in spite of the circumstances. The family might not all be together in person, but we're together in spirit, and you always have me. I love you so much. Happy birthday.